Delsys do a lot of things very well, but what we really focus on is the delivery of high fidelity uh, electromyography sensors, um, which really allow us to understand how the brain communicates with the muscle. The project that we're working on at the moment with Manchester Metropolitan is looking specifically about how some muscles change in terms of regional activation when we implement different mechanical stimuli onto the muscle. We're working on using a new sensor that they've developed to explore how muscle activity changes during a cycling task. Traditionally with high density EMG sensors they've been um, perhaps tethered to another machine so it's difficult to learn how the body behaves when, when it's in motion and also it's to do with the, the fidelity of the signal so making sure that we have the clearest possible uh, signal from all the electrodes across the grid. A lot of the questions which Delta's looked to tackle um, with some of these new technologies and some of all of our technologies really are based around some of the key engineering principles to the detection of the electromyographic signal. So that is making sure that we get uh, high signal to noise ratios, uh, low motion artifact and high um, skin muscle conformity um, with the electrodes so that we can have a dynamic situation and that the contact for the electrode on the surface of the skin stays intact during all of these, um, again, highly dynamic movements um, to be able to yield high fidelity signals. So this project is important because it gives us a really um, close relationship between a company and industry partner that's developing new ways in which we can explore muscle function and the research side in which we're trying to find out new knowledge, new understanding. It's going to really help us understand what's going on on this more fundamental level. So having that technology um, to explore new things in ways that haven't been done before, so that innovation is really exciting. What we can offer and what the project can offer potentially going forward is that it showcases um, the use and the application of these technologies and allows others to be able to um, draw on some of the inferences that we'll be making and then use that within their own work to be able to better rehabilitate, better diagnose and better um, train athletes.